Hey YouTube family. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day y'all. So I just hopped on really, really quick. Um, I just wanted to share some information with y'all and share a small haul. Um, so I went to Walmart. I got some stuff to make shrimp tacos. So that is what I made. Um, once again, didn't pick the camera up. I got to get used to picking the camera up because how am I going to start my other channel if I don't show y'all what I'm cooking and stuff. Anyways, picked up some Clorox wipes. Um, I picked up two lint brushes um, because I like to use these to clean off my um, boucle chairs in my bedroom and in my living room. I use the brush, but I like to use these also. And then I just went and got some more um, candle wax. This is the peach mango. You can smell, smell it through the uh, package. And I have the candle. I love the candle, um, peach mango. And this one is the Hawaiian coconut. Cause I love coconut, peach and coconut and pineapple. Those are the, the scents that I normally mix together for it goes good with my chemistry. And I think I told y'all that a long time ago. And then um, I got the Fresh Cut Fraser. I shared this with y'all already and the Frosted Lemon Bars. I shared this. And then I just went and got me some more vitamin D. So one of the reasons why, besides sharing this that I wanted to have on is because um, some of y'all um, that are friends with me, um, sorry about that, that are friends with me on Instagram, which I used to do pretty good on my Instagram while I was off and on, but I don't, I don't really post on there like I should. I need to start it all over and kind of delete some of the stuff I have on there and then focus more on what I'm doing, like the decorating and different stuff. Anyways, um, so I'm not the type of person that likes, to, I'm like pri private, I'll just say that. So I never really came on and said anything about anything that's personal in my life. I'll just say that. I say what I want to say, nothing really personal. But I got a video, like I, I told y'all a while ago, I don't know if that video even came out yet, but I, sh I did a, a Q and A video and that's been almost a month. I have not put that video out. I'm planning on putting it out on Sunday. Planning on putting it out on Sunday. Um, but uh, one of the things that I was sharing about it is that my granddaughter, um, back in 21, she was only two years old, getting ready to turn three. She, she in September of two, 2021, um, we found out that she had cancer, and then um, she turned three um, that October. That October. Okay, so she had the cancer and everything. So in 22, she got to ring the bell. She was cancer free. But she still had to go down to the children's hospital, um, Mott's Children's Hospital in Ann Arbor, um, for her six month scans. And so every time that she would go, everything was so good. Everything was good. My granddaughter never got sick. She never, um, you never could tell that she, that something was wrong with her besides her losing her hair from the chemo and radiation. Um, but her hair is long and it's thick now. But um, yeah, so she rung the bell back in 22. And like I said, she still had to go back for her scans every six months. And she went today for her scans. And um, today, I think, I'm, 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 don't quote me on the days, but I wanna say her mother said that um, today uh, marked 902 days ago that we found out she had cancer. And 582 days ago that she has been clear, clean from cancer, clear. So with that being said, they said today is the first day that she is 100% cured from cancer. So cancer free. And so it just made my day. It just made my day. It made everybody's day. Everybody we just been so happy. So I do want to do something special for her to celebrate. Um, she hung out with me today after she came back from the hospital. And um, we just went out. She went out with, well, she was here with me. And then we left and then we went to visit my mother. And um, yeah. So, but I want to do something special for her. I want to throw her some type of something, party or take her somewhere. So that will be happening. I hope, I, I would like for the weather to break. I really would like to have something in the yard so that everybody can come. So I'm going to just play it by ear on when I'm going to do it. And But the, the occasion will be about the occasion. So just happy, happy, happy tears and um, just happiness. So when she was at the hospital today, um, I guess it was, 
um, some ladies that brought in a lot of flowers and stuff like that for the patients in the hospital and stuff like that to get, you know, they can make their own bouquet of flowers. And so she kept saying, Grandma, I got a, a surprise for you. So when she came over, let me show with y'all, share with y'all. She did it so beautiful, y'all. Now this, this is my granddaughter, she's five years old now, y'all. So like I said, that's been um, two years. Let me see, wait, she was two turning three. So it's been two years. So let me show y'all, look at this. Ain't that so pretty, y'all? These flowers are so pretty. Fresh cut flowers that they brought to the hospital. They said it was like two truckloads of them, um, of flowers, but so pretty. And I love the choices that she put, uh, made and put together. I love, love the daisy, love the rose, of course. I don't know what this one is. I'm a type of a lily, but I love that. And it's another one. I don't know if it's the same one. I don't know what these are right here. But I see the little lilacs, and I don't know what these are. But anyways, I really, really do. Oh, it's got uh, eucalyptus in here, too. But I really, really do love this. I love it. And it's in a little can. <laughs> so, yeah. <clears throat> it's so nice that they did that for the kids and for the patient, other patients and stuff like that. But, yes. Been overjoyed today. Overjoyed, y'all. So, I just want to hop on really quick and just share that with y'all that we serve an awesome, awesome God. So I will talk to y'all later. I just wanted to share this uh, good information, good news. And um, I'm getting ready to um, mop my kitchen floor. I just got through washing the dishes and I'm gonna make me a couple more tacos and um, the shrimp tacos that I made and watch me some TV. Um, I've been trying to upload my video since yesterday, early yesterday, and it's still, let me look at it now, see where I'm at. I just said, boy, I don't know what they be doing, boy, I'm telling you. <clears throat> I just want to show y'all that I'm on my phone, but so I don't know if you really be able to see it like that, but um, I'm trying to see. Anyways, let me just do it like this. Uh, 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 uh. Wouldn't we'll do it like this. If y'all can see that, where it says it's still uploading. Anyway, it's been since yesterday. Been since yesterday. Why am I still at 60 some percent and it's a whole nother day? Come on, help a sister hide, okay? But anyways, y'all, I just wanted to let y'all know that. And um, I, I just, like I said, just happy. I'm happy, that was some good news right there. That was some really, really good news. So, but like I said, I will talk to y'all tomorrow. All right, bye. Good afternoon, uh, my family. I gotta come up with a name for y'all. I think I got one, but um, yeah, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start that in, in a little bit, real soon, y'all. But I think I came up with a name for y'all. Cause I'm tired of saying my YouTube family and friends. I need a nickname for y'all. But anyways, happy Friday, y'all. Happy Friday. I just wanted to hop on, share with y'all um, when I did the collaboration with. Um, about for my um, chandelier in my kitchen um i didn't never put the lights in i had never changed my lights when i first did it i took the light bulbs out of my old one because they were just alike basically they one was just stainless steel this one is gold 
took the light bulbs out of that one and put them in the new one and with that being said this one needed more light than the other one that I had um I made just the light the other one had 12 lights needed 12 lights and then the other it was spears sticking out on this one each spear is a light so it's 18 lights so I got the lights the same lights that I purchased for my chandeliers in my bedroom it's a little dark in here because I ain't turned the light on yet but these are the lights right here that was that I was using for my other one the long lights and these are the lights that are in there now still got a couple of them left but yeah so these are the lights I'm just trying to show you without the light being on hope you got a good look at it now I'm turn the light on so bright in here okay. so I like the round lights and these are the feet um, electric enhanced vivid natural light they're 40 watts each and um, they are dimmable and I got the daylight uh, lights because I needed um, it to be bright especially when I'm recording but it's just so dark um, <laughs> see look over here and I know it's more light over here but when you look over towards my kitchen with the other light it's not as bright over there and I thought it would be even brighter with me getting a light like this like this one um, that don't even have a cover over it so but anyhow yeah I just wanted to come on and share I do have the lights in now and everything and it's giving that light that look that I was looking for so yeah all right I'm gonna clean this mess up because I was taking the light bulbs out and one of the light bulbs exploded on me and when I say glass went everywhere it, it, up, it I think it was more than one when it fell down because it was hot when I took it out and when it fell down I had the other light bulbs on the table so when it hit it because it, it, it dropped out of my, I dropped it out of my hand because it was a little warm and um, it hit the table where the other lights was at exploded it was just like glass went everywhere so I swept I done moved the table and swept this dining area swept the hallway because it went all down the hall I see some in the kitchen area I haven't swept yet so I'm gonna sweep that and then sweep my living room and then I'm a, I had to vacuum my chairs and everything but anyhow yeah these lights were about to go anyways they dark around I don't know if you can see how dark that is let me put it up over here and you can see how dark it is right there probably it's gonna go pretty soon anyways but I really love these lights right here these are the ones that I chose and I like the ones that was all white also, but it would have been dim, uh, dim in here. It just would have been too dark, and that's what I didn't want. So, But anyways, I will talk to y'all later. Hey YouTube family, happy Saturday. So y'all, um, yeah, today is um, Saturday, February the 24th. Um, oh, somebody's turning out, I was getting ready to get over. But anyways, y'all, I just wanted to hop on really quick and just say, hey, um, I just left from the bowling alley. Um, I'm, I went, I'm, met my cousin up there she went to go meet some of her relatives but she said meet at three o'clock and me and her met at three o'clock and they didn't get there until um some two of them didn't get there until uh maybe um four o'clock and then the other ones didn't get there and i mean they're just starting to really come now but you know i still had things i had to do and so i'm like okay i already sat here for two hours and they still hadn't had a lane or anything so i left they just um got a lane a bowling night so yeah i left um yeah so anyways i just wanted to hop on and just let you know that i did get just a little bit of footage in there 
Um, I didn't go down where the arcade was at. I just kind of turned the camera a little bit around from where I was sitting. But yeah, so I hope everybody is having a blessed day. Um, it's nice and sunny, but it is cold as I don't know what out here. Um, yeah, so not right now. Well, you know what? I just left right up the street was the place called Far East uh, Market. And that's where I go and get my ginger tea. So I just left there from getting my ginger tea. And now I am headed to get my script. And then I'm going to run through Tommy's or vice versa, however, to get my um, car washed again. So I just went a couple of days ago, but I'm going to go back in through again today. And then um, I was thinking about going in Target, but I don't know if I want to go to this Target uh, or another Target um, about 30 minutes away. But either way, go if I go there, I will pick the camera back up. So talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, so I stopped at KFC. On my way home, I got mashed potatoes. Y'all see my hot sauce next to it. I got a biscuit, I just uh, put honey all over it. So I got a two piece, right? But I got an original <laughs> leg and then I got a crispy breast. I really want a spicy, but they don't have it. That's the one that I um, went to. So. All right, well, I just wanted to hop on to say that really quick. Y'all see I'm sitting on my bed getting ready to eat. I done changed my clothes and everything. And um, I'm gonna put on the jogger suit and head back out in a little bit, but I just needed to come and sit down and rest and eat. So, all right, y'all. Okay, y'all, look. So, um, look, this is my mail right here. I share with y'all um, my other RH book that came. And that's the thicker catalog, which I really haven't had time to just go through it yet. But that book, the, all of the plastic was off of the book when I got it out of my mailbox. I was really irritated at it because I, I felt like somebody opened it up. Plastic is not that thick, but it was all the way down off, you know. So anyways, the second book came today. And um, I don't know, um, somebody was looking at one of these books. No. They wasn't looking in the book. I was in, um, let me turn my camera around. This is the book, hold on. Okay, y'all, uh, so I'm still laying back in my bed. So, how I ended up with these two catalogs, even though, like I said, one came last week and this one just came today. Um, I don't know who was doing a video in the RH um, store. I can't remember who I was watching that was in the store. I don't know if it was Elle or if it was somebody else that was in there, but however, I know that when they went to one of the tables, you know how you can go in the furniture stores and they have their, their ads, like they sell books or something like that in there. It was a lot of them on the table spread it out. So I said, I wonder, can you just get a catalog? If I can get a catalog. I went online on their site and I, I did a, typed in a message and said that I wanted to get, you know, some of their free catalogs. And they sent, sent, them, sent them out to me. I just filled the sheet out that, and, uh, they sent them out to me because I thought that the books that they had, their uh, magazines, would be nice coffee table books. Like if you just want to open up a page. So this book right here looks like it's just majority of um, outdoor furniture because I, I opened, I just took the plastic off. So I'm going to turn it around just let y'all kind of see right quick. Hold on. I don't mind my blanket and stuff. Y'all see it? Look, it's my granddaughter's Minecraft blanket. It's so thick and so warm. So, yeah, I got it just sitting on my bed. Because this is what I was covered up with. But, anyhow, uh, I'm just going to kind of flip through a little bit. But, yeah, it's majority of outdoor furniture, which is very pretty. Very pretty. Like, the sunrooms and this furniture is so pretty. Like, i never seen outdoor furniture like this but I know when you go to the richer stores you know you'll see a lot of different things I hope it's not a, a real bad glare because y'all know I'm in my room and I don't have my light on I'm just chilling and thought I'd open the book and share <clears throat> that is so pretty so pretty Oh my goodness, just gorgeous, just gorgeous. Look at that, just natural colors and everything, just pretty. A lot of different ideas. 
more to dream about and manifest about. So, yeah. Yeah, so I just wanted to come on and just share that with y'all real quick. Um, uh, I think I'm about to throw me a pair of jogging pants on and a hoodie or a sweatshirt. And um, head out to my aunt's house. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm tired. But she called me a couple hours ago. Maybe a couple hours and a half ago. <laughs> and so I think I might just... Um, Slip something on that's comfortable because I had on a jean jumpsuit and um, I don't know. I was already tired when I left home earlier and just sitting there so long, just sitting in the same spot for so long, you know, not walking around anything like that. I don't know. I just, I don't know. I just felt tight, like just tight. So I wanted to take that off. So yeah. So I'm gonna slip on some jogging pants and stuff and um, yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and head on that way.